Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. Do -do 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 -da -da -da. Today I'm actually doing a collaboration with my friend Saria over at Dream It DIY. Now she and I are both DIYers. Her channel is completely dedicated for the most part to doing DIY. I would say probably 90% of her videos are DIYs and they're amazing and she typically does ears. So when we started talking about what kind of collaboration we wanted to do, we knew we wanted to do a DIY and she was like, let's make each other a pair of ears. So you will first see the ears that I made for her and let me tell you, I was like, I'm gonna do this like amazing, gorgeous, topiary, flower and garden inspired ears and it did not work out. They are still beautiful. I'm really happy with the way that they did turn out. So I did this really, really beautiful purple ears and if you wanna see kind of the finished product and her unboxing, I will link everything below her video, her channel. She's amazing. She has become one of my dearest friends over here on YouTube. So please go check out her channel. So with that said, you're first gonna see the tutorial of her ears on my channel. So let's hop into the tutorial for Saria's ears that I made for her. So let's start off with supplies. You're gonna need some floral wire, some ribbon, but I ended up using a purple ribbon. I didn't use those craft balls. I tried to use them to make that topiary. It didn't work out. Um, a headband, some flowers, some hot glue, and then like Gorilla Glue or E6000, and then also some twine. So first I started off by cutting the floral wire and actually it was like in a nice size circle so I didn't really need to change too far away from that but oh guys here you're gonna watch me mess with this wire for literally the next 45 minutes. I had to speed it up because it took so long but it took me 45 minutes to get really great placement on this wire. I ended up really happy with it, but go watch an ear tutorial. I did not watch a wire ear tutorial. Sarius got one, but of course I didn't watch it because I was like, I'm going to do this organically. Well, it didn't work out. And of course I said nothing about scissors, but you do need scissors. I finally figured out that I couldn't double up the wire. I needed to make it just a single ear wire. So I cut it and then I started to reshape it. I went and grabbed myself a glass to make sure that the shape looked okay. And from there, I really started to move along in a successful direction. And I did kind of match up both sides just to make sure they looked pretty similar. And then after that, I just cut the purple ribbon. Like I said, I didn't use the pink, I used the purple. And I wrapped the ears on that way um, and hot glued them. So next I decided to wrap the entire headband part in twine and I really wanted to give it kind of like a potted plant almost look so that's why it's got that brown on the bottom and I wrapped everywhere that I potentially could with the twine. So friends this is plan B. This is I went out and found these at the 99 cent only store and I love them. I just think the flowers are so beautiful and I picked them off of this. I got this kind of flower and then I got another purple flower because it matched the floral wire really beautifully and I really wanted to give it kind of that potted plant almost feel and I love purple. I think purple is so beautiful and obviously I didn't do violet lemonade because I didn't have any lemons, but I wanted to give it kind of this. I just thought it was really elegant and beautiful. And then I just started to arrange them in a way that I thought looked 
good. So I ended up doing, I arranged it on both sides. So they're kind of interchangeable. You can wear on one side or the other, though I do prefer the side that you're kind of seeing right now to the other side just because the three big flowers are in the front. But um, it's pretty interchangeable and you can actually wear it both ways. Now I felt like I was still missing something so I decided to use these gems that I actually also still got at the 99th and only store. Um, they're actually for a future DIY but they were purple and I think they added just like a tiny bit of elegance to the rest of this floral piece. I just I thought it added some little extra to it. It was really pretty. So those are the ears. I think they turned out really beautiful. And let's hop into the unboxing with Sarius ears. So I hope you guys enjoyed that ear tutorial. And now we're gonna do an ear unboxing. And she sent me a pair of ears. And so I'm super excited. Now they're flower and garden inspired. If you didn't catch that, I'm sure I mentioned that. But in case you didn't, these are supposed to be flower and garden mentioned or inspired because we wanted to do just like something that would work for right now in the Disney parks. And I am actually, I'm not sure when this video is gonna go up, but I am actually leaving for the Flower and Garden Festival um, in like four days right now. Oh my gosh, she's so cute. Look at what she did. She put it on a little flower and garden thing. Okay, Allison, so glad we are collaborating again. I had a lot of fun making these ears. And to be honest, my husband actually came up with the idea after I told him what I wanted to represent. I hope you like them. Thank you for being such a wonderful friend. Love, Saria. She is so sweet. Freaking adore her. Oh my gosh, look at her. Okay. Well, Saria, you wrapped these beautifully. <laughs> She did, so obviously, oh my gosh, she did the violet lemonade, which was like, I didn't put the lemons on mine, but oh my gosh, these are so cute. Oh my gosh. These are so beautiful. So you'll see mine are totally different. They didn't have the lemon on them, but they do have like a violet aspect. These are so freaking adorable and they're so comfortable. <gasps> Thank you. Well, I'm glad I went back and re-examined them because they freaking light up. Are you kidding me, Saria? So I'm trying to find where the light switch is without like, oh, it's on the back, okay. <gasps> what? I did not turn them on. They light up freaking purple. Saria, you're so much better at ear making than me. I'm sorry about my disappointing pair of ears. <laughs> These are so cute. Are you kidding me? What? <laughs> yes, I am gonna be the best. What? Rosie, she woke up. That's why I had to like run away. Oh my gosh. 
Priya, thank you so much. These are so beautiful. And like I said, if you want to go check out her channel, her stuff is linked below. And if you are coming over from Saria's channel, thank you so much for joining me today. I'm so glad you're here. And if you haven't joined my Disney family, go ahead and hit that little red subscribe button and give this video a thumbs up. It really helps me figure out what kinds of content you guys are enjoying. And as always, I hope to make your trip just a little more magical. See you guys real soon. Bye.